Here we go, I'm the sixth time recording this New Year's video. I was gonna upload this because um, uh, I was getting frustrated because I keep messing up and I'm not liking it and how it turns out. And But I watched other people's New Year's videos and I was like, you know what, I need one video for the end of the decade and I'll try to get out late tonight. <laughs> oh my god damn it. But yeah, anyways guys, I'm the Brides, how's it going? Today's video, we're going to be doing many years in Real Talk Vlog, the one Real Talk Vlogs I still have on this channel. There's, then there's the birthday one, and that's, <laughs> that's really it, unless I have something big to update you on. But usually on the birthdays, and th this one I usually update you at the end because of the fact that I don't do this much anymore. So anyways, let's get down to business, let's talk about 2019. So 2019 has been an okay year. You know, it's been all right. It wasn't the best year, but hey, it was. Uh, it was still. It was. It was a year. You know, it was. It was good. Like 2018 was really good. It was nice. I was okay with it. Actually, 2018 was the best year. 2019 is like. It happened. I graduated high school, went to college, dropped out of college. Made a new YouTube channel and everything of the sort. So everything, my life's in shambles right now, you know? <laughs> I have no word, I have no idea what I'm doing. I just throwing things at the wall and seeing what sticks. I'm mainly just following my dreams and seeing how far I could take this and before I have to take reality into check and like say, hey, you know what? Uh, real life's a bitch. Then I have to like get a real job and stuff. So uh, until then, I'm gonna keep doing YouTube. I gave myself a good four years, that's a lot of years to waste, but <laughs> we'll see if it works out in the end for me. And anyways, let's like categorize it, okay? So you, basically my year revolves around YouTube, and there's like graduating high school, which was amazing. I'm glad I'm out of that for godforsaken school. I'm pretty sure everyone who graduated that year is like, yeah, we're good, we're out, we're, we're, we're done guys. <laughs> Everyone's fucking happy, and uh... So that, that's no, that's nothing's the, it's, it's, I'm the same, you know, I'm the same, uh, I'm fucking happy I'm out of that school, it's great to be uh, at home, I guess, but hey, I still could be doing more, that's still a fact that I have to face, uh, I've been pretty lazy recently, as you can probably tell my upload schedule, I've been pretty lazy, I have to try to get back into it, but I've been drawing so much, the drawing has taken my life, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know why I got back into drawing so much. Now I just end up drawing instead of making YouTube videos. So the time I would spend making YouTube videos, it, it would be on drawing. And yeah, <laughs> that's, that's how it's going. Um, it, it's So yeah, I graduated high school, went to college. That was a good experience. I liked experiencing it. Uh, it was fun, I guess. I had a nice, nice time, you know. But uh, things change. And if my friends are watching this New Year's video, then... Um, Bye, I guess. I won't see you again. <laughs> I'm gonna stay home. I'm gonna be a dropout and just gonna focus on YouTube for a while. And I'll see what happens next. Uh, it's just a fun time. A very stupid decision. But a decision I don't regret making. And I plan to make this work. That's just how it's going. I'm making the leap. I'm taking the jump. And uh, we'll see if I fall into misery and despair and waste four years. Or if I rise up and become the YouTuber known as Anime Uprise. And we'll see how that goes. Orange Kobe Joe's manga. That one's still up in the air. So YouTube wise, yeah, I'll get into that now. My real life stuff just going to college, jumping into college, and going to high school. And now the big part, uh, the big part of it is YouTube. So, yeah, I guess I'll have to tip. <laughs> this, this is the big discussion, guys. This is where it all is. It's real life. I haven't done much. I just graduated high school, went to college, and jumped out of college, and moved to houses, so I guess there is a lot to talk about this year. <laughs> I also moved houses, by the way. If you, well, you guys must have known that. I'm, I guess the new surroundings, or I guess the new <laughs> new surroundings for new people, the old place, and the other old place where my, where my channel started back, back in the day. I moved like twice this year, and we moved back. It's just like a lot of moving. And a lot of uh, change. That's what I'm gonna call this year. It's like the year of change for me. There's so many change, so much self-discovery. And that is just the big fact of it all is that this year is the most, the year I found myself, I guess. And I realized that, hey, college isn't for me. Like a lot of people will probably be, be frowning on me and say, you're lazy, it's how it is. I am lazy, that is, 
a big matter of fact. But um, I never thought college was for me. But I only ever thought that it was the way to get to Japan, which still is the way to move to Japan and work there. But I realized there's a way to get to Japan by following my dreams too. So I'm gonna try that way first. And then if I can't, then you know what, college I go, and then I'll get a work visa and work in Japan. You know, that's how it's gonna go if I, uh, if nothing else works out. But if this works out, then you know what, Japan it is. I'm gonna try to become a YouTuber and go to Japan. That's the how I wanna work it out. That's the dream, and um, I took the leap for it. And this year has been the craziest year ever. Um, it was the most stressful year. Here's where we're getting to the big, big boy, the YouTuber type of thing. You know, the, the big, the big one. <sighs> Here we go. YouTube is... YouTube was a big thing this year. It was coming off the coattails of the best year I've had like in 2018 my channel grew to sizes that I, I didn't think it was gonna grow the year I, don't, I expect 100 subscribers then I got 50 more than, than my my initial thought 100 subscribers that's it as far as I'm getting that year I'm, I don't even make it but then I got help from the community and I got pushed up to 155 and then even throughout until May I was still gaining subscribers like crazy I was still going up and up and up until 215. That's when things fell. Of course I was still gaining subscribers occasionally, but it went from like say 8 subscribers a month. Yeah, it's not that much, but like 8 subscribers a month to like 3 or 4. No, not even. Like fucking 1 subscriber a month. <laughs> a month? <laughs> So yeah, I, I knew I was doing something wrong. I didn't know what I was getting wrong, but I couldn't fix it. Uh, and I tried so hard, I, I was thinking so hard, and I was just so stressed out this entire year. Well, as well as getting through high school, as well as going to college, as well as like figuring out my life. YouTube has been like the dominant part of my life where it's just like, hey, videos, hey, statistics, hey, you're doing bad <laughs> your, your dream is going nowhere what are you doing and it's been in my mind forever and finally it came to a boiling point to when i decided hey i was standing at the shelf and saying i'm gonna focus on kobe talks japan now and that's when things got to a boiling point and it only kept getting hotter and hotter and hotter until eventually it boiled over and that's like a boiling <laughs> fucking i don't know what to call that metaphor <laughs> Uh, it boiled over and it exploded and I uh, made the new Anime Uprise channel. And here we are. Uh, I restart from zero and you know what? It's, it's the best decision I've ever made. I just, it made me realize so much about my community and the art community as a whole with like the anime and manga, otaku community. Uh, it was great, you know. It was nice. I loved that. I, people came over. I, remember, I know I, I said this a lot in the past, but I, I said only five subscribers. I only thought that's many people were gonna come over. I knew like Swoozy was probably gonna come over. My friends, that was like four already, and I only expect one other person to come over. But I got 34 people that are for sure from the old channel. <laughs> you went past my expectations, like beyond that. Over five times more than I, I man managed to get, or I thought I would get. And you know what? That made me the happiest boy in the world. <laughs> no, I was so happy. And I, I made me appreciate my overall achievements with my channel even more. Even though I didn't get, get to the heights I wanted, I still I can appreciate what I did on that old channel. <laughs> and, and how I reached out to people, how I got people liking my content. How I got people who enjoy what I'm making, which makes me want to keep making more besides the bad statistics. And you know what? <laughs> I'm still thankful for that. And one of the funny thing is, even though my subscribers are, are low by low subscribers than my old channel, it's doing about the same it would on that channel as well. <laughs> Although I did have some failures in this past week, which is why end reviews are kind of taking a hit. How <laughs> I just want to do visual models for a bit, but I'll talk about that more at, at the end. 
So yeah, I made this new channel and you guys came in for me. Made this year, uh, the tail end of it, uh, one of the best. Like I, I never appreciated my YouTube community and this, the anime community as a whole as much as I did in these last two months. 54 subscribers, you know, that, that, that's something, uh, it took me over a year to get. I think around the time I got help from Jim Graves and Toaster Cat and the other people like that was when I had around 80 subscribers and they gave me 20. And that has to say in something because that was over a year. I got their help in like, I think October and it took me that one to get 80. So that's only 30 more than I have now <laughs> or 26. And I got 54 in basically two months. On the like tomorrow, it's two months time, and that is crazy, you know. Less than two months. That's that is just something I can't comprehend because it, it took me over almost two years to get over a hundred. You know, that, that was just that was close. Uh, this was what this one is like. I got so much more fans now. Our friends, 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 friends. I'm not sure what the. I got YouTube friends, I got fans, maybe. It's nice to know people are, it came over here and like, like my content, and enjoy my content, enjoy, enjoy my new stuff and just everything like that. And it's really been a tough year on me with YouTube and everything. But thanks to this new channel, I've gotten a new appreciation and I've gotten my drive back, or kinda. Drawing is like sapping it. But I'm still happy to be doing YouTube and I don't want to quit so I think I have to issue a thank you here I know <laughs> I usually do a thank you um, like a lot but I am genuinely so so grateful for everyone who subscribes to this channel everyone who takes the time to watch my videos no matter how long I know statistics get to me all the time and that's just how it is I look at the numbers and it's just a hobby of mine to look at the numbers and you know what it always gets me down, but just knowing that you, tr you, you took t time to try it and, and see if you might like it, just, you know, what? I, I, I appreciate that. And for everyone who came over from the old channel, I am sorry for my indecisiveness throughout this entire year. I, I think I owe you an apology for that. I am so, so sorry for everything that's been going on this year. Like, I've been so wishy-washy. I've been everywhere. I've just been going all over the place and it's not been the best year for me and I'm just I'm sorry about that I have to issue that apology because this year has been the toughest year on my YouTube for ever even, even like the more tough than the first year and that is uh, saying something and you know what I'm just thankful for all you guys that came over I was kind of expecting to start all new gain new fans gain new new people around and just no you guys stuck around you guys still watch me you guys still you know support me and that is uh where that is and you know what that's it's crazy and uh, i just wanted to thank you all for that <sighs> let's have a great 2020 you know let's make 2020 a year i get back to where it was before i want to at least get back to where it was before 220 more than it was before, was before. I want to get back to 220 so I can keep rising above that and keep going. So that's my uh, goal for this year, 2020, is to make it back to 220 just so I can say I'm starting from where I was before. I'm going up now. Because right now, I almost worked my way back up to where I was before, so I'm not really going anywhere. I'm just like kind of in my shadow, you know, I'm more required where you are racing to shadow. Well, basically, it's kind of like that, and I'm just, I'm just trying to catch up to as before and now I'm still in that phase so when I get back to that point I'll be able to truly grow but with that said guys I'll get into updates now so basically uh, I do plan to make a drawing channel that is something I want to do but it's not I'm not sure I'm gonna release it yet I'm not sure I'm gonna start it yet the channel's already made like the channel page is already up so if you want to go subscribe to that then this links will be in the description because uh it's still up but there's no videos yet I still have plans to do it but I want to get better at drawing on the tablet a bit more before I do any more of that, because drawing digitally is kind of tough for me, and I have no clue what I'm doing. I'm so used to traditional, and um, you know what? Um, drawing digitally is fun, but I have to get better at it. And so I do, I do plan to open the Kobe Draws Manga 
with videos soon, maybe mid-February at most. Uh, that's a long time, but hey, if you guys want to go subscribe early, then links will be in the description. And yeah, the Gimme channel is also cancelled. And Oh, great, my dog. Yeah, so I do plan to do that drone channel. Anyways, I lost my train of thought, thanks to the dog. But anyways, uh, next is um, a life update that's going to happen, maybe. I might be going to Japan in the summer. I'm going to be sure going to Japan in 2020, but the time frame is like either in the summertime or in the fall. One or the other, it really depends on how things work out in my life, but I do plan to go to Japan this year for sure and live there for at least three months. At the very least, three months, I'll be there for. And I, I'm, I'm, I'm excited for that. I really am. Because I miss Japan a whole lot, and that's just the fact. And then I guess we have more YouTube updates. So I do plan to make only uh, Sakura Shrine Girls content for just a while <laughs> until I finish the game. The end reviews will come back after that. I just need a break from it for a bit. Uh, that's just my excuse. I need a break from end reviews just for a little bit. That's just how it is. Uh, I've been doing them for over four years now. Uh, I think it's four years on different channels. And I think it's about time I do different content for a bit. And visual novels are a good outlet. And especially because I'm enjoying Sakura Shrine Girls a lot. <laughs> I'm really having fun. I've already recorded episode three. I have it recorded and I have to edit tomorrow. This video is first. And yeah, you know what? Uh, that's all the updates I have. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. It was rambly, and again, thank you and sorry uh, <laughs> about me being really indecisive this year. But also thank you for coming over and giving me a second chance and just enjoy my content even more. It means the world. So with that said, guys, I'll see you guys all in 2020 and the next decade. So yeah, Johnny.